Ten years ago, Valeria Levitina got into the Guinness Book of Records as the thinnest woman on earth. Just imagine, with a height of 171 cm or 5.6 feet, she weighed only 25 kilograms or 55 pounds. Levitina desperately tried to enjoy every day and dreamed of a fulfilling life, but because of a serious eating disorder, her story was tragic end. Here, listen to her story. Not so much is known about the biography of Valeria Levitina. She was born in 1973 in a wealthy Moscow family. The girl grew up as a very smart and talented child. From an early age she played the piano and even wrote poetry. According to the, her own words, Lara did not attend secondary school, but she had friends and admirers too. It is no wonder, all photographs clearly show that the girl, she was quite a pretty teenager. In 1990, 16 years old Levitina, together with her mother and father, went to live in the USA. After moving to a new place, in Valeria's soul heard something broke. It would seem that the dream of many teenagers about life has come true in a progressive country like America. Yes, and the 90s in Russia were a time, softly speaking, not the best for life. But Valeria loved Moscow very much and the moving was give, given to her very hard. In adolescence, the girl, like everyone else, decided to try to lose weight. By the way, it was necessary to lose quite a bit. Valeria's weight at that time was 63-65 kilograms, it's 135 or 145 pounds, and only slightly went to beyond the norm in relation to her growth. One day, a familiar boy decided to play a trick on Levitina and started in plain text. With your parameters, you can stand on the football goal without missing a single one ball, he declared. This words hit Lara hard and unfortunately forever stuck in a memory. Arriving at the, her mother, Levitina shared her experience with her. But to her big surprise, her mother believed that her daughter really need to lose a couple kilograms. Then the girl began to develop a weight loss plan, realizing that relatives and friends consider her as a donut. Lara started to lose weight. At first it was innocent diets with calorie counting, then the exclusion of sweets from the diet, and on, a, on top of it, complete elimination of carbohydrates. She couldn't stop when she saw the first results. I must say that the rapidly falling weight pleased her and her mother too. Girl turned into a really slim beauty and started taking part in American beauty pageants. It seemed that for Valeria it was possible to overcome the complexes and became who she dreamed of. But the mother Joy did not last long. From slender model to beauty queen title holder, Lara quickly turned into a sick person. Her weight continued to fall and stopped this process she couldn't no longer. Going to the doctors, Valeria's family heard a terrible diagnosis, anorexia, disease in which the body simply refused to eat. At that time, the 24-year-old young woman weighed about 37 kilos or 81 pounds. In the form of her condition herself, she could not adequate evaluate reality. Girl wanted to lose weight more and more. And even then, the first problems began to appear. It became difficult for Valeria to lift even not to heavy bags, tie shoes laces, get up from a chair and other simple daily duties. Relatives and doctors tried to help her somehow, but almost all attempts ended unsuccessfully. Levitina's weight either increases or fell again. The critical mark on the scales was the figure of 25 kilograms, 55 pounds. Valeria has now been recognized as the thinnest woman on the planet, officially hitting the famous Guinness Book of Records. In early 2010, Levitina began to lead a social image life. At that time, she had already moved to the south of France in Monaco. Living and studying at a local university, the woman decided to share her problem in a social network with thousand girls with anorexia. In the form of a photo of Valeria before and after losing weight, many simply could not believe how from a 
such spectacular beauty she was able to turn into a walking skeleton, but the fact speaks for themselves. The state of Lara did not worsen until a certain time, but she couldn't even put on a few kilos. On the first day of winter in Monaco, her body couldn't take it. And on December 1st, 2013, Levitina died. That's all the story is ended. If you enjoyed the video, please support me with a like and don't forget to subscribe. See you soon. Bye.